How are you? I'm always amazed by all the children that we take care of in the Children's Hospital who are just so resilient. They're definitely not defined by their diagnosis or their disease. My name is Matthew Greaves, and I'm the Chief of Pediatric Plastic Surgery at UT Health and Children's Memorial Hermann Hospital. And I run the cleft and craniofacial team here at uh, our UT Health Clinics. So I've wanted to be a doctor from as long as I can remember. And I grew up on a farm in Indiana, but I didn't really have anybody in my family who did anything in medicine. And by the time I got to medical school and started looking for something I wanted to practice for the rest of my life, I actually was fortunate to go to a lecture on plastic surgery, and particularly pediatric plastic surgery very early on, and really was inspired on how uh, these surgeons took children who were born with these really visible birth defects and gave them a way to get back to normalcy. My job is in two parts, right? So I'm a pediatric plastic surgeon, so the main part of my job is to operate uh, and to actually take the children's lip or palate, uh, which are part of their birth defect, and make it whole. So a vast majority of my time is spent teaching parents and the children once they're older about what surgery means, and also getting a chance to understand what they want and make sure that our goals are aligned before we kind of embark on this quest. Almost three pieces, right? In particular with cleft lip and palate patients, they have a very visible deformity, so everybody can see this and so their goals are to go to school and have no one say anything about it they want to just be a normal kindergartner a normal third grader i think we do a really great job with surgery i think we do an awesome job with therapy i think we do a great job with our dental programs to set those children up for success so they're not feeling like a patient they're not a diagnosis they're a child and they're a normal, healthy, happy, well-adjusted child in school so they can have a great life.